I've had coffee this morning. It's early. <laughs> if you're new here, my name is Melissa and welcome to my chaotic mess. And yeah, and ignore this. Today, <laughs> oh, you guys are probably like, girl, you're spending too much money. We're doing a that up haul with try on. Um, so just so you know, this is not a sponsored video. But they did give me a link that if you guys wanted to sign up, you would get 45% um, off plus free shipping on your first order. And once your order ships, they would give me some promotional credit for recommending you guys. So if you are interested in ThreadUp and you have not signed up already, Feel free to use my link, help girl out, because I am trying to rebuild my wardrobe as you've seen before. I cleaned out my closet and got rid of 90% of my clothing. So that being said, I decided, you know, and this is not that exciting. I mean, it is for me, but probably not for you guys. There's only, I think, seven items. But I decided, since I live in Florida, I need to invest in more shorts besides like joggers and biker shorts and I also got an item that I I don't know what I was thinking and we'll get to that but um so yeah let's get started I've already opened it because I was trying to figure out why the box was so small and here's the box by the way here's the box Isn't that crazy? I mean, it probably looks huge to you guys, but when I picked it up, I was like, there's no way all the clothes I ordered because I ordered jean shorts and jean shorts are typically heavy. So they all fit though. So let's get started. We're gonna just pull from the top. This is the only shirt I got. It is from Torrid and it was new with tags. Crazy. This top is so pretty and I am going to try it on, but I know for a fact it'll fit me. If anything, it might be too big. It is a three. I typically wear a two there, um, depending on what type of material it is. This is more of a flowy material and it does have buttons. So a three probably is better that I got a three because the more fitted it is, the more the buttons are gonna pop. So, plus they're adjustable straps. So that's usually what gets me on the bigger size is the strapping. So we will see, we're gonna try all this on. We'll see, we'll see that one, that's the questionable item. That's the questionable item. I got a pair of shorts. This is a brand I've never tried before. It's called and Andy Way Can you see that? They marked it out, but that's I've never heard of it before. But also I got these in a 20 26 apparently. I think these were the ones that said like 3X and I was like, okay, we'll try it. But they apparently are, I don't know, they're probably going to be too big. Oh, you know what I think it was? I think I got the 26 because when I measured, there's a, a thing in here. Um, when I measured the other, short, not measured, but when I looked at the measurements of the other shorts of brands I had worn in the past um, these looked like they ran smaller because they it, on thread up they do like a waist circumference measurement thing on these I guess um, so it looked like they ran shorter so or short smaller so that's I think that's why I got the 26 these ones I got I'm hoping 
they're 24 some of my pants in there are 22 guys i honestly don't know what i wear anymore i know 24s will fit me because the shorts i have in there are 24s they are loose but i that i hesitated buying clothes because it's like I'm one of those people, if I can't try them on, I usually don't like buying them. And you can return with thread up, but they charge you a restocking fee. So I will probably just keep them. And either if they're too big, I'll either just donate them or if they're too small, I'll wait because I am working on losing weight. So anyway, these ones are pink on the I didn't know they were pink. I'm like actually surprised because on the um, on the website they looked peach, but these are pink. I hopefully they look pink to you guys. They are pink, and these ones are Lane Bryant, so I have a feeling they're gonna fit fine because I used to buy clothes from Lane Bryant until they went all grandma. Sorry if you like their clothes. I haven't been in a while though, so maybe they reverted back. But for a while there, they like went all grandma where everything was like, looked like something my grandma would wear. And I just, it wasn't my style. So a lot of stores ended up doing that to me. And <laughs> that's why I went exclusively Torrid. These ones, I don't know about, guys, I... I am honestly new to being comfortable wearing shorts. Like, we're talking about a couple years new. So, um, oh, I didn't tell you this. This is Avenue Denim. I don't know where Avenue is from. I'm not a brand person, so you know me. I buy clothes from Walmart. I don't care. But someone went through the trouble of ripping off the back label and everything on these. These are 24 as well. My only thing is, like, holding up, up this way, they look too long. But then, <laughs> I got these. These ones are the ones I'm like, oh, this is, this is not the, uh, the uh, one item that I was like, what the hell am I doing? These, though... I guess I need to start paying attention to inseam. Inseam. My husband said try them on. They might be fine. But I think they're going to be booty shorts. And if they're booty shorts, I will, I will never wear them. These are Ava V Midi. I also got these in a 24. Um, but look how short they are. These are definitely booty shorts, right? Is it just me? I'm going to try them on still. But, guys, I'm not out here trying to show my butt. <laughs> I'm really not. These. Okay, this next item is something I really, really have wanted for the longest time. But believe it or not, unless I, like, got Carhartt or some from the farmer's store... And even then, they were pants, and I wanted shorts. Um, I couldn't find them in my size. And so, when I seen them on Thread Up, I said, oh my god, I don't care. Who's going to make fun of me? This is in the brand Wallflower. And they are, they just say 3X. But they look like they will be big enough. But they are, hold on. They're tangled up. <laughs> That's what they are. <laughs> They're bibs. They're bibs. Or overalls, whatever you guys call them. I used to have some when I was a teenager. I loved them, but they were pants because, you know, I lived in Indiana. But I'm excited. And I might look like a stupid whale or something in them but you know what guys I loved my bibs when I was in high school and I ain't mad about it even if it's just some lounging around the house running errand type of situation I don't care I'm excited 
Now here's the thing, <laughs> here's the side I'm like, what the hell am I thinking? Because some of y'all don't know, but sometimes I have an overactive bladder <laughs> and I just, I have to be able to, you know, like these ones have like these, like da 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 da. They have these, but then they do have a button. So I'll probably never button these because I need like to be able to get my britches off quick. Same thing with the bibs. Like, okay, I have never be able to wear these while traveling because I have an overactive bladder. But this, <laughs> this, first of all, I don't know if it's gonna fit. It looks kind of short. It said it was, here's the thing. I'm starting to think it's a bathing suit. I don't know. It's got this built-in, it's not bathing suit material though. And it's got the liner thing. So I'm starting to, it said it was a romper. Maybe it is, I don't know. But I don't know how rompers are. I thought they were shorts. I thought the under part was shorts for a romper. And this is not shorts, this is, definitely the bottom definitely feels more bathing suit like except for that it's cotton linered i don't know i don't know guys like this was my what the hell am i doing with uh item so if anything i guess i could just use it as a bathing suit i don't know this was in a size it's by cherokee plus and it's a 24. Did I tell you the brand of overalls was Wallflower? Anyway, let's try all this crap on and see what I don't like. <laughs> all right, here's the thing. This is a freaking, this has to be a bathing suit. I would never, ever, oh my God, this is, this fits like a, uh, ignore the bra guys. I just, but can you even see it? See how it's so, I would never wear, I don't know. Is this a romper? I like, there's no shorts, not to be weird, but it's, it does come down lower than my underwear. So, I mean, I guess I can give it that much credit, but is this a freaking romper? Is, am I going to get made fun of if I was like to go out in public in this? Because it, for one, it's just, uh, I don't know. I don't like that it shows everything. So. <laughs> when I envision, when I think of a romper, I always see the girls with like the rompers that are like super baggy on them, I guess. It's not very form fitting. But this is very form fitting. You're gonna have to let me know on this one because I'm my own worst critic and I feel like it it looks like a bathing suit. So let me know guys. Let me know. Alright, so this is the shirt. I decided to try the shorts on some all the shorts on too. Well, not all, but you know what I mean. Um, these are the shorts. They are, these are the Lane Bryant shorts. They are loose, like I predicted, but they're comfortable. They go down, um, at a good length. The shirt fits so nice. The, <laughs> remember how I said three would be great. I keep worrying that the buttons are popping, but when I look down, they're fine. So I like this shirt. It's nice and comfortable and it's very florida <laughs> so yeah i'm happy with this combo i'm probably gonna leave the shirt on for the rest of the shorts try-ons but these are the shorts i feel like you guys can't see and i can't go back any further you can though that's that's new of you now you just went all crooked now you're looking into my closet. Oh, well. Anyway. Is that better? 
so you can kind of see these are all the clothes I'm getting rid of I'm letting my sister-in-law go through them first before I and I've decided I'm not gonna sell them to throw it up I'm gonna donate them um, I was originally gonna sell them to thread up but the way it works is you don't get any credit until your clothes sell so if my clothes were never to sell and if they didn't want any of them I wasn't gonna have them send them back because you have to pay for that so I just decided to donate them so anyway let's go on to the next one let me know what you think all right ignore the shirt because I tucked them in so you guys can actually see the shorts but these are the Avenue denims and they are a little longer I know I'm fat and I shouldn't care about length but they're a little longer than what I normally like I normally like it to be like a little bit above the knee these are literally right at the knee but they are comfortable so I'll give them that I don't know how to get any closer without lowering this. Let me try lowering this. Okay. There we go. That's better. I don't look so far away. So, still far away, but you see what I mean about the knee, though? How they're, like, right at the knee, which is fine. It's just... Uh, that sounds bad coming from someone that doesn't wear shorts, but like I found it's more comfortable if they aren't right at the knee, like if they're just a little bit above, so like right about there ish is where it's most comfortable. But these will be fine. These will be fine. And they're not too heavy. That's the thing I was worried about. They have a pretty good fit. They're not like tight. There's still room. Um, these ones are 24 as well. I think or were these the I think they're 24 okay these shorts were the ones that were like a 26 I would definitely have to wear a longer shirt with these because they aren't stretchy but they are already trying to fall down so like not off off because you know my butt is gonna hold them up but fall off my hips basically they're comfortable though they're very lightweight these might work for Disney shorts, honestly. You probably will see this after Disney. I don't know when you're seeing this. But they're very lightweight. They have pockets. Let's untuck this. How's that look? This looks like I'm wearing a dress. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I am genu genuinely surprised. These are the ones I said were going to be booty shorts, but they are actually pretty nice. Like, they are shorter than I would normally buy, but they're pretty comfortable. And they don't show my butt. They actually don't show my butt. I do feel myself wanting to pull them down more just because they're not naturally where I would wear them. But... They're pretty comfortable. You know what, guys? I'm, I, I for one, will say I'm surprised. You'll have to let me know if you think they're too short for a fat girl. Um, I won't be offended. I really won't. Um, because, again, I have only been wearing shorts for about two years. Well, since I become an adult. <laughs> And these are like the usual types I wear is uh, jogger shorts or biker shorts. I have one pair of linen shorts and that's it. So this is, this is all pretty new to me. I used to wear shorts as a teenager. Um, no, not even teenager, preteen, pre, uh, actually child. Um, <laughs> so, when I started gaining weight, I stopped wearing shorts. I became very self-conscious of um, because I gained all my weight in my rear end and my thighs at first. So I was very like small up top. And what is that shape where your 
big on the bottom, but small on top. I'm still kind of that way, except for now I have the belly. So, um, let me know, guys, because again, I I used to I used to be very self conscious. I'm not very self conscious anymore, but I also, um, if you're gonna tell me I look stupid, I don't want to wear it. <laughs> It's not a self-conscious thing. It's just being comfortable in public. I don't like public anyway. So, I... These actually might be the Disney shorts. If you guys tell me they're not too short. Because I'm going to be in a wheelchair or a scooter. Which, well, hopefully a scooter. If not a wheelchair the whole time. Except for when we're riding rides. So, it's not like anyone's going to really see me standing for too long. Um... And for all you guys who are probably sitting there going, why is your fat ass getting a wheelchair? Why don't you just walk? I have spinal issues and my pain management doctor actually told me I needed to, that he wanted me to get a wheelchair because that was going to be too much walking. So that's what I'm doing. I'm listening to my doctor for once and yeah, so one more, one more thing to try on. All right, take 30. <laughs> um, I couldn't figure out the crisscross back. I'll have to figure it out when I get them off. So right now they're just uncrisscrossed, so they would definitely have to be adjusted. But these are the bibs. Um, obviously this isn't the right shirt for it. You're gonna want a shirt that's more fitted, not flowy, um, like a cami or a tank top. But these are it. They're really loose right here, again, because I couldn't figure the crisscross out, but you don't have to crisscross them, which is the good thing. So if I wanted to leave them like this, I could just tighten up the arms on them, but they do have a crisscross brace thing that I just undone um, because they, they weren't working. They weren't untangling when I was trying to pull them back up. So... Um, these I definitely could not travel in because, again, my overactive bladder. <laughs> but, like, if you wanted to be nostalgic, you just, you know, wear old 90s like. I mean, they wore it like this in the 90s as well, but, yeah, I like them. I'm happy with them. I got them mainly for nostalgia because I wanted to remember the good old days and this is helping again mine were pants and really now that I think of it those weren't the good old days I mean my niece was born so that was good but that was back when I hated school and I stopped going <laughs> and that's a whole story I did graduate high school guys so um, I'm a dropout that actually graduated high school, not a GED, because I did go back just to a different one. Um, that's everything, guys. So, I want to go ahead and thank everyone for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. Any questions or concerns, let me know how you liked these outfits, which one you liked the best on me, which one you think I should just... <clears throat> <laughs> never try again um <laughs> I won't be offended guys I'm putting this on the internet so I have no right to be offended um but yeah that that be now and if you haven't done so already subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one bye